This movie tells a story about how reggae icon Bob Marley overcame adversity and the journey behind his revolutionary music. First of all, music is the best part of this film as it delivers some concert scenes with Bob Marley's iconic songs. Unfortunately, everything else is bland. This biopic is rather lifeless, lacking spark, full of cliches and perplexing choices. It's shallow, pedestrian, and emotionally hollow. The movie struggles to locate the man behind the legend as it fails to tell the audience why Bob Marley became a legend, nor how he still matters to millions of people to this day. Many aspects of his life are presented blandly, with scenes full of bad dialogue and awkward framing make them look rather anonymous. It could be any other musician as they do not feel specific to Marley. If the audience wants to know anything concrete about Marley, they are consistently blocked by vagueness and proclamations by other characters about his greatness. Those who know little about Marley will emerge from the film feeling not much wiser. The script explores Marley's past through melodramatic flashbacks providing too simplistic explanation for why this musician was so driven and so haunted. Many aspects of his life are potentially intriguing, but the film glosses over details rather than digging into them. Bob Marley begins as a stranger to the audience and ends as one as well, because the script doesn't stop to let the film breathe and get to know his heart, mind, and soul. There's undoubtedly a lot going on inside of him emotionally, but the movie dehumanizes him by neglecting to show that side of him, especially as he and his wife leave his beloved homeland. The unimaginative cliches continue in the scenes that depict the making and recording of Exodus album. He's surrounded by his band, The Wailers, yet none of those characters are given any distinctive characteristics. The character of Rita has been left underdeveloped as well, so when Rita eventually confronts Marley, their argument feels oddly arbitrary. The important dialogue scenes between them lack the necessary context and detail to truly hit home. Both main actors who play Marley and Rita cannot bring any heat to their marriage with the material they are given. They play the characters as siblings more than a couple with no sparks flying whatsoever. Surprisingly, there's not enough of Marley's music in this musical biopic as well. The audience who will buy tickets to this film primarily to see and hear Marley's music will be disappointed. Overall, there's not nearly enough insight into Bob Marley's life in this movie. The end product is typical of too many music biopics offering colorful highlights rather than sharp insights. How he birthed such powerful songs during such difficult times remains a mystery. It's not worth to watch this in theaters. Just wait on your streaming service.